about the acceleration when I got like your daughter doesn't three kids. she doesn't like it no she's uh, like your car's too loud <laughs> is it four person <laughs> the American I make, Commodore I make no yep guarantees that you won't have like brownies or or jolly ranchers stuck to your ass because i just took the kids it's fine it's free food out. why would you complain about free food yeah, this, this is unique because this is a commodore that's oh being used as an everyday vehicle yeah push There's... button start you have the key yep i think so we can talk to each other we may have to put the windows up when we get out on the road so what do i need to know before i go you will sometimes feel like you want to grab second or third and it will just throw you in the fourth and it will give you a little warning right there mm -hmm. um additionally if for some reason you stop on a hill most of the time it will hold the brake for you you're not going to get a roll back to like slowly engage the clutch the first time that happened to me i stalled it out okay because it was just so weird okay and that's pretty much it you got a heads up display and it'll tell you everything else all right parking brake off, off down down yeah. All right. And uh, there's four different suspensions. I, this what we have is it on perf right now? Oh, uh, they'll they're buckled in. So we got, you got a, sport, sorry. tour. Yeah. So you you hear how like tour is? Did you hear the exhaust get quiet? Yeah. Yeah. That's touring. And and you'll feel like touring the suspension is very washy. Like you kind of float over bumps like this, and it actually made my daughter car sick when we did it. Really? So, yeah. Because it's like it is very weird. And I find that that um, sport is like the best every day, and then you hear it turns up the exhaust yeah. a little bit. Performance makes it really rigid, which isn't great for Pennsylvania roads, but it was fine when I was down in Florida. All right. Um, well, we'll keep it in sport then. Yeah, sport's good. This well, I got to remember. Oh, this is definitely compound bow feeling clutch. It's, Who's not buckled up? Who's not buckled up? It's yelling out of someone in the center seat, and there's no one in the center seat in the middle. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Do we have the ground clearance for this? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what it is about, like, because I have a, like I said, I have the Fusion, and, I, uh, and the Fusion actually scrapes when I come out of things like that. But for some reason, I don't know if it's because this one has a bit stiffer suspension. When I come out, I usually don't scrape. Okay. See, mine with my Forester, I put it into first, let off the brake. Yeah. Yep, there it holds it. But then it stops. But then it gets, oh, <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I told you, it, 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 uh, it, it freaked me out. It will only hold it for a few seconds. My Forester holds it forever. Really? No, mine only. It's just, it's, a it's just some switch everywhere. No, no. That's freaking weird. <laughs> I told you. So, so how do people uh, disengage the hill start? I don't think that the, they do. Oh. It's the uh, it's the it's the gear skip that, that you can disengage and you can you you get a, uh, a a resistor and it goes on top of the transmission. Okay, where am I? All the way left. Straight, straight, straight. Straight, straight. straight. Yeah. Now right. left. Yes. Pittsburgh, man. <laughs> Not a straight road to be found. No. Can't head check. You got these are really good. The, uh, the blind spot monitoring. If you see a little thing there or something there. See so, a little thing where? Right here, at the top top right of the mirror. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's that's usually pretty good. Where's my mirror? There's my mirror adjust. Yeah. Pittsburgh is a video game. This is <laughs> Pittsburgh is this little bit of LA interchange in Pennsylvania. If I lived here and I knew every little nuance, I'm sure it'll be amazing because the way Pittsburgh's, oh, the skyline, this shot, ah, uh, this is beautiful. Man, when we were driving at night, if I could find a way to film a car here at night, what do I want to do? You want to stay in this lane. Please. Stay in this lane? Yeah. Okay. Because we want to take you into the city and you'll come around to get on the road. Yeah. Okay. So we are in, I don't know what gear, fourth? Fourth. That's fifth. Yeah, That's sixth. sixth. It just puts along. 
six, I, I'm have my foot on the floor right now. It just yeah. So, so six, it will be a very, very good highway gear. Turning oh, yeah. one thousand five hundred. That's, that's what I told you. I mean, doing doing ninety to one hundred and ten miles, <laughs> uh, doing very high speed. Uh, and at a closed road in Mexico. On a closed road in Mexico. Okay. Uh, I was getting which way? Straight. Okay. So I was yeah. getting 22, 24 miles per gallon, going at that rate of speed in six gear. It was just. Oh boy, I'm in a fast car and I'm in downtown Pittsburgh and I'm not on a motorcycle. What do I do? Panicking. Do I have? Yeah, yeah you're good. You're good. Which okay. lane? And I get in the left. All the way left. All, maximum left. Yes. You're all good. You're better off if, you're, if you know it on your back. Okay, now that we're down in the city, I am going to go for tour. And if anybody gets sick, or if I get sick, we're gonna go back in the sport. <laughs> we'll be all right, we're here. Um, yeah, if you head straight left from this intersection, it'll take you to the boulevard pretty straightforwardly. Man, downtown Pittsburgh, this feels so claustrophobic. Oh yeah, well just wait till you have like, you know, buildings falling on you and stuff. Oh boy. They had they had a, a couple, a couple things where like, some dude's car just got creamed down here. What was it like? When? Five or six weeks ago. A, a built a piece of I think a piece of oh. building fell on his. Um, yeah, that actually did happen. Yeah, <laughs> right across from the that. courthouse. Yeah, right, right from because uh, yeah, it was right across from the courthouse. He was parked. He was a he was a school teacher, and uh, chunks of building are falling off. <laughs> yeah, that that they've had scaffolding up on that building since. And this makes me a left. Yeah, yeah take okay. a left here. <clears throat> I, uh, this is not a protected left. Yep. Are they going to expect me to Pittsburgh left? No. Okay. There's never an expectation to Pittsburgh left, but they might delay thinking you will. Okay. Yeah. But this is a horrible place to do it yeah, anyway. Don't just, yeah. Not, a, not over two lanes. Yeah. Um, I've seen people Pittsburgh left at this slight, and in the morning there's always pedestrians. So mm. it's like, oh, I just Pittsburgh left, and now I can't finish the turn because there are pedestrians. Oh, nice. It's, it's a nightmare. It's totally <laughs> fun. This interchange is always throws me because of this lane coming in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the whole thing shifts, yeah. and everyone has to turn left in that lane. Yeah, it's weird. Now you have a. Very Does the throttle response change for tour? I don't know. I don't. Mm -hmm. Not that I've experienced. From what I remember, looking at the at the engine when we did the engine shots, this does have an electronic throttle. Yeah. A lot of Matt Happel's builds with the LS's, he changes it back to a mechanical one for simplicity's sake and also for hooning's sake. Yeah. We're, uh, talk to me, Goose. Just stay straight. Stay straight? Yeah, yeah. just stay straight. You're going to go through a weird tunnel. Yeah. Okay. Like, like, a, like the straight. building tunnel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's the G90 that we just saw. Yeah. Oh, look at that. So pretty. They are. I mean, I was looking, I was actually, when I was looking for this i was actually looking at one of those yeah. as well the gene genesis are so nice yeah i mean again it's a uh a, a five five liter v8 yeah it's not like this though no it's no, not yeah. no it means, it means it's not droning you feel, you, do you feel that like when you're going over it's like a wallow it's like a like i said it's like a little bit of a washy feeling yeah Straight? Yeah, you're going through that little. Do I want le left hand side or right hand side? It's all one. It's way. all one. Oh, way. it's okay. Yeah. It's, two <laughs> lights are mis mysterious. Right. I'm going through the building. Yes. Yep. <laughs> this used to be a Kaufman's. Yep. Kaufman's chicken? No, Kaufman's yep. department store. And then Macy's. Continue straight through it and after it. Yeah, you're right. It is kind of washy. Yeah. The suspension, I I don't like it. Yeah. Whereas if you put it in the sport, it feels it feels yeah, rigid enough. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry. Left. Straight road. 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 Straight I am in sport. Okay, now this is the four, fourth. This is cheating because this would be gravity assist. Yeah. Well, the third, 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 and fourth are where the engine sounds the best when you're really able to get on it. And fifth. 
that there's like a one to one on six and overdrive. Cruising at 50 miles an hour, the engine is turning 1,200 RPM. Yeah. <sighs> and this seat is nice. It this is. seat is nice. The, the steering wheel's thicker than I'd like it to be, but it's sort of a generic GM steering yeah. wheel. Um, does it stay, tell stay us straight? Stay, stay straight. straight. Yeah, you're gonna stay straight. Stay straight. Don't stay straight. Stay straight. Yeah, both of these are not straight. <laughs> it's the way that the lane runs into it, so right. it's hard to give it. Bare left. Yeah. Bare left is straightish. It's a Pittsburgh direction. Sorry. <laughs> Man. Nice. <laughs> that wasn't even that. That was like I think I'm in fourth still. Keep going straight. Yeah. Or keep following this. Okay. All right. Oh, I'm in third? Yeah. All right. That's weird, that hill start. It, it gets like one 1,002 and then expects you to be pulling out. Oh, that one to two shift, man. Sorry about that. No I've Just because the uh, UP police are right here, um, <laughs> I put it into tour just to close those baffles yeah. on the exhaust. Yeah. <laughs> Not to be that guy. <laughs> Don't want to be that guy. Putting it back. Oh, you're right. That 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 tour setting is so washy. Yeah. Yeah. Recommend this. I hope I remember to put it in the review. Don't even bother with tour mode. No. Just keep it in sport. Save it for when you have to shut that engine up. Yeah. Just shut the exhaust up. Apart from that, I think Ferrer or something else talked about that. It wants it sport mode suspension, tour mode exhaust. Yeah. Right. That's what it needs. Continue staying in this lane. You're going to use this lane to merge on the cross down gold board. So okay. do not change the yeah, just... Does it rev match, or do I have to do it if you I go down? Do it. Okay. Oh, that was a bad one. That's dodge that pothole. Then. Yeah, 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 dodge that one pretty good. And roll into it. Oh, it's so good. It's, it's, uh, it's just so good. It just doesn't care. Uh -huh. okay. Red line is exactly at six. No, I think it's 6,500. It gives you. It says six, but I think it, you can actually go above that. Yeah. You know, just stay in this lane, and it'll take you off of this little ramp. Sharp curve. It's yeah. Like right here. Okay. It's not the sharp curve. It's this one. Oh, here. that's them. Yeah. It's Pittsburgh. It's sharp. <laughs> yeah, it's still sharp. It's just not the same sharp. <laughs> oh, this is the one that's gonna be badass on a motorcycle. And I'm yes, down. it is yeah, a no. great motorcycle worker. I can believe that. Which way? Just Sorry. stay where you are. Oh. I'm going to get ahead of this guy. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Oof. Not even trying. <laughs> no. Just decide to do it. Don't have to worry. Either lane? Uh, right lane. Yeah, eventually right lane. That's fourth gear pull. Yeah, That's third, third and fourth gear nice. pull is just so great. It's going to open up an even farther right lane. You'll get into that. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yep. Oh, but that lane ends? Oh, no, but I no, still no. need it. Yeah. No, you still need it. It's the exit lane, yes. I'll bet even in automatic this thing would be good. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I wonder what transmission they use. Is it the 4L80? Well, that's only a 4-speed. Maybe a 6L80. Or something. Ah, Wikipedia will answer that. Yeah. <laughs> the comment section will enlighten you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Promise. Whether you want it or not. Do I stay in this or get over? Oh, yeah. Yeah. you have to get over one lane. Oh. <laughs> Too much rev. <laughs> <laughs> and this will uh, get you back to the exit that gets us under the bridge. Yep. This is very yeah. This is a very nice Pittsburgh car. It. I think Pittsburgh demands something with a little fatter tire, a little bit more ground clearance. Oh, imagine this car if someone did like a safari version of this. Oh my God. <laughs> a little bit ground clearance, fatter tires. Actually, but then it would get washy, wouldn't it? Would, it? Yeah. Like yeah. when I when I first got this car, I think it came with like um, with BF Goodrich Potenzas or something like that. Potenzas, yeah. Fantastic tire. I. I had to cross my fingers to get ten thousand miles out of them. For real? Yeah, they they just they just wore down to like you know baloney skins in a very short amount of time. Yeah, 
now I'm, I'm running, I think, Continental, um, what is it, like DS6 or something like that, mm -hmm. like you can see them on there. And I can definitely feel that it is not as grippy as the, the Potenzas were. Um, when I'm like, you know, doing certain miles per hour on the turnpike, going around a turn, mm -hmm. you know, I can definitely feel that like the rear end is like, kind of really working to keep grip, but the original tires that came on here, they had so much grip, you know. I wonder what this would be like if you had like, you know, Michelin Pilot Sport 3s on here or something like that. You could really do some stupid. Mm, there is no, <laughs> yeah. there, there is none of that. It, this needs to be lower, but that's just modern car design being what it is. Yeah. Uh, talk about like 10,000 miles on the tires. Yeah, the, uh, the Pirellis I had on the Urge to just thing. hoon this entire thing. Yeah. Oh, you have uh, no idea how many times I've gone around a turn. I was just like, don't. Don't. The don't. Head. Don't. <laughs> don't. <laughs> Don't be don't. that guy. <laughs> Remember, don't. Because in your head, you're awesome. But then yeah. in the reality, you're going to hit a curb and break your wheel. <laughs> in reality, you're just another guy. Yeah. Well, thank you, Jared. Well, this has been a delight. Yeah. This, this is a, what I'm taking away is that this is a road trip machine. Yeah. It's, it's a large car with a smaller interior, but it does fit you very snug. Mm. It is not an Impala. It's n it has that Malibu look, but it's not a Malibu on the inside. The American Commodore. The phrase isn't there before the grace of God go I. This is a, a flash in the pan of what could be in the United States. Yeah. I think they'd be just fine calling this a Commodore in the U.S. Be well, this, this is fan service for the U.S. Man. Only it stuck around. Well, because Holden didn't. Holden didn't. Holden didn't. Like I said, it's just like I, my my concern is just that the, the America will never make another car like this again. Stick shift, sedan, man. LS. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, man. Oh, my pleasure. There's a ton of room back here. Oh my, yeah. oh my gosh. I'm so comfortable right now. Like, yeah. I am Ridiculous. like, well, I can lay down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, I'm. If I had this as a lift car, and it would work, it's perfectly legal for lift, four-door thing, and, you, and your approval rating would go down. It's like, well, welcome, guys. <laughs> Except for that gas mileage thing. The gas so mileage thing. thing. I will say, oh, when I took this on a trip, I will, what I would like to do is, is put a, a thermometer in there to see how hot the trunk gets. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Because when we drove down to Naples after Spirit screwed us for, for two, week, uh, two weekends in a row, um, we just shoved everything in there, including all of my wife's makeup and stuff oh. like that. And when she went to pull it out, it was completely melted. Really? Yeah. We didn't even look at the trunk yeah, space here. in this thing. Holy crap, Jesus. Yeah, the, yeah the, that's a decent... You could fit it's so flat, many too. Dead. Yeah, the, the, flat. the seats don't fall down, but it does have a pass-through. Oh, batteries in the trunk, huh? Yeah. Oh, that's what you uh, donut or full? Uh, you can get a full, that's that's but that's I didn't get that. That was the only option. Oh, like, there, but I there can, is no... There is no... There's no, it's just the fix a flat, which oh. I've never used. Is that a pump? Yeah, uh. with like a special, you know, injection thing. But it, it, you could get it with a full size spare. I was, there were only a couple of options: transmission, and it does. You can like latch it up here too. That was, that was <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, I would probably get a donut. Yeah, I would or too. Something. I'm, it's something I'm considering doing. This is, shouldn't, should not be doing so that was like the doing. nice thing, like so few options, there was full size spare, 